With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello friends, the question is, find the particular solution of the given differential equation x plus y dy plus x minus y dx is equals to 0 and it is given that y is equals to 1 when x is equals to 1. Yeah, so we are given the differential equation which is x plus y dy plus x minus y dx is equals to 0. So firstly, I will write this as x plus y dy is equals to this will uh, taking this to the uh, right hand side so this will become minus of x minus y or i can write this as y minus x dx yeah so from here we'll get the value of dy by dx is equals to y minus x divided by y plus x yeah now since you can observe that this is a linear dif uh, homogeneous differential equation yeah this is a homogeneous differential equation yeah so for solving this what i'll do is put y as equals to bx yeah now differentiate both these sides with respect to x so we get dy by dx is equals to using chain rule here firstly v as it is differentiation of x will be 1 plus x as it is differentiation of v with respect to x will be dv by dx and also from here we can say that the value of y by x this is equals to v so now for solving this i'll change this thing as putting dy by dx as equals to v plus x times dv by dx is equals to y is equals to vx minus x divided by again y is equals to vx plus x okay now we'll simplify this so this will become v plus x times dv by dx is equals to taking x common from numerator uh, we will get x into v minus 1 divided by again taking x common from denominator we will get x into v plus 1 now this x and x will cancel each other so what we are getting is v plus x times dv by dx is equals to v minus 1 divided by v plus 1 now take this v to the right hand side so we get x times dv by dx is equals to v minus 1 divided by v plus 1 minus v now on taking LCM what we will get is x times dv by dx is equals to v plus 1 and in numerator we will get v minus 1 minus v times v plus 1. Now again we will just simplify this thing. Yeah, so this will become v minus 1 minus v square and then again minus v divided by v plus 1. So this plus v and minus v will cancel each other. So what we have here is x times dv by dx is equals to taking minus common 1 plus v square divided by v plus 1. Now we will simply separate the variables. So what we will get on separating the variables is v plus 1 divided by v square plus 1. Yeah, times dv is equals to minus dx by x. Yeah, now we will simply integrate both the sides. For solving this so this will become integral of v plus 1 divided by v square plus 1 dv is equals to minus integral of dx by x okay so now what we'll do is i'll write this as v divided by v square plus 1 dv plus integral of dv divided by v square plus 1 yeah and this will remain equal to minus integral of dx by x okay so now for solving this integral this thing what i'll do is just simply put v square plus 1 as equals to t now differentiate both the sides so we get 2v dv is equals to dt yeah and using some standard integral results which we know is that integral of dx by 1 plus x square this is equals to tan inverse x and also integral of dx by x this is equals to log x okay plus some constant c we can say so now what this will become is this integral this will change to integral of v dv is nothing but dt by 2 so dt by 2 and this v square plus 1 is t plus this integral d 
this is integral dv divided by v square plus 1 is equals to minus integral of dx by x. Now we will solve this. So this 1 by 2 is constant. So we can take this out of integral. And integral of dt by t will be log t plus integral of dv divided by v square plus 1 will be tan square, ta sorry, tan inverse v is equals to minus integral of dx by x will be log of x. Plus we will have some constant. Let's say that constant is log c. Okay. So now, just put the value of t here as v square plus 1. So this will become 1 by 2 log of v square plus 1 plus tan inverse v is equals to minus log x plus log c. Now again, putting the value of v here. Okay. So what we will get is 1 by 2 log of value of v is y by x. So this will become y square divided by x square plus 1 plus tan inverse y by x. Now take this log x to the left hand side. So this will become plus log x is equals to log c. Or I will write this as 1 by 2. Okay, 1 by 2 into log of, just take LCM here. So, this will become x y square plus x square divided by x square plus tan inverse y by x plus log x is equals to log c. So, now if we multiply by 2 in this, in both these sides, so we will get here log of y square plus x square divided by x square plus 2 times tan inverse y by x plus this will become 2 times log x is equals to 2 times log c. Okay, so now using the property of log which is a raised to the power log x so we can write this as log x raised to the power a. Okay, so this will become log of y square plus x square divided by x square plus 2 times tan inverse y by x plus this will become log x square is equals to 2 log c. Now again using property of log which is log a plus log b in this term and this term. So log a plus log b is equals to log a into b. So this will become log y square plus x square divided by x square into x square yeah plus 2 times tan inverse y by x is equals to 2 log c now this x square and x square will cancel each other so here we are getting log of y square plus x square plus 2 times tan inverse y by x is equals to 2 log c now we need to find particular solution. So we are given a condition that is y is equals to 1 when x is equals to 1. Given y is equals to 1 when x is equals to 1. So putting it here what we will get is log of 2 plus 2 times tan inverse 1 is equals to 2 log c. Yeah, so this will become log 2 plus 2 times tan inverse 1 is pi by 4 is equals to 2 log c. So from here we are getting log 2 plus pi by 2. This is equals to 2 log c. Now let's say this is equation number 1. So what we need to do here is put in, put the value, put the value of 2, 2 times log c in equation number 1 directly. So, by putting this, we will get the particular solution. Yeah. So, what we will get is, from here when we will put the value, so we get log of y square plus x square plus 2 times tan inverse y by x is equals to value of 2 log c is log 2 plus pi by 2. Yeah, so this is the required particular solution of the given differential equation. Yeah.
Thanks for watching. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.